Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Scott Lim, Friendly Neighborhood Dentist. Before we start, please do subscribe to this channel. Different subtitles like English, Chinese and Malay are available. On the video, first click the CC button, then settings on the computer or the three dots on your phone to change the subtitles to a liking for better viewing experiences. Thank you and enjoy the video. Welcome to this series of Brush Brush Brush. I believe you have watched my previous video on how to select a toothbrush, the do's and don'ts of toothbrushing, as well as 5 different techniques of toothbrushing. If you haven't, do spend 5 to 10 minutes to get the gist from watching those videos. So in this video, I'll be giving you tips on how to take care of your babies and kids' teeth for them to have healthier teeth. Never too soon to introduce your children to the importance of teeth and mouth care. By setting a good example and establishing a good routine early, you'll be laying the foundations for a lifetime of good oral health. Oral care for babies and kids are different for different stages of life. So we can divide them into different stages. For stage 1, is 0 to 6 months old. Oral care can start before your baby has any teeth. The milk and food can leave the deposits on the gum, allowing the build up of bacteria that gives the bacteria food. Then after taking in the breast milk, the breast milk will stick to the tooth surface, allowing more bacteria to stick on. And with the bacteria consuming the food remnants, they release the acid as their byproducts, and the acid will lead to white spot lesion, which is the early stage of tooth decay. And if not cared for, it will lead to even more severe tooth decay. So it's very important to wipe or brush your baby's teeth after each meal and feeding. To clean your baby's gums, wrap a piece of gauze around your finger and use more circular motions to wipe around your baby's gums and teeth. No toothpaste should be used for babies less than 18 months old. For stage 2, it's within the category of 6 months old until 3 years old. Baby teeth can start to appear as early as 4 months. Some parents may think that care for baby teeth isn't too important as they will eventually be replaced by the adult teeth. However, the adult teeth are already developing in the jaw and the baby teeth reserve the spacing for the adult teeth. If the baby's teeth aren't cared for, tooth decay and gum disease could occur and cause problems later on. So this is also the weaning stage around 1 years old when babies move from milk only diet towards solid food and other kinds of drinks. Now is the time to start good habits by ensuring a baby or toddler isn't taking any sugary food. Bottles and cups containing fruit juice, soft or fizzy drinks are a definite no-no. Follow these tips to take care of baby teeth as soon as they emerge. If a baby or a toddler, it's easy to sit them on your lap with their head resting on your chest. Using a soft brush and a smear size of 1000 ppm fluoride toothpaste is suitable for this age group of children less than 3 years old. Use small circles to gently brush around all the surface of the teeth and massage the gums. Spitting after brushing should be encouraged rather than rinsing with water. Rinsing will wash away the fluoride from the toothpaste and it won't be effective. And you can start dental checkups for a baby at around 6 months when the baby teeth begin to appear. And for stage 3, which is 3 to 6 years old, by this age, all the baby teeth should be present. Children don't find the coordination to brush their own teeth until around 7 to 8 years old. So you still need to brush a child's teeth. And this age, it's easiest to stand behind your child and tilt their head back. And this way, you'll get a better view of all their teeth. Increase the amount of 1000 ppm fluoride toothpaste to a PE side. Using small soft toothbrush, gently brush around all the surface of the teeth and gums. Now is a good time to introduce flossing to the routine, but only if you feel your child is ready. Also, ensure your child is having regular dental checkup. From the age of about 7 to 8, children should be able to brush their own teeth. You may help at first by holding the brush in their hand and showing them what to do. And then they'll need to be supervised for a while afterwards too. They can learn how to use the modified base technique. The size of 1450 ppm for a base is recommended for them. Speed up after brushing. Ensure that you brush your baby's or child's teeth at least twice a day. Use an egg timer to encourage brushing for 2 minutes. Here are 5 quick points from the American Association of Pediatric Dentistry, APD, on how to prevent early decays in your kids. First off, we shouldn't put baby to sleep with bottle and avoid night breastfeeding after the first baby tooth comes up. Baby should wean from milk bottle at around 12 to 14 months old. Frequent consumptions of liquid containing fermentable carbohydrates from a bottle or non-spill training cup should be avoided. Start teeth care as soon as the first baby tooth comes up. Recommend to have oral health care checkup at 12 months of age to educate parents and provide anticipatory guidance for prevention of dental diseases. Hopefully by educating a child and encouraging good habits at an early age, the child will look forward to a lifetime of healthy mouth teeth and gums. That's all for today. Hope the information above helped you in some way. If you feel this video is useful, please help to subscribe, like and share this video with your families and friends for more upcoming dental videos. Please feel free to drop by any question in the comment box below and I would like to hear from you more. Remember to brush 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 and see you in my next episode.